Hello everyone, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for May 21st, 2019. Let's see what we have going on today. Okay, we have the lover's card. Okay, so this is interesting. Now, whenever the lover's card comes out, we always wanna caution everybody, and people hate this, but if you're getting ruffled that I'm about to go down a certain road with this instead of just telling you what you wanna hear, you're the person I'm talking to, okay? Whenever this card comes out, everyone's like, oh yes, I'm gonna get that love partner I've been stalking for six months. No, you're not, not without police intervention, okay? <laughs> You need to back up. You need to back up and you know, you gotta respect where other people are as well. This lover's car talks about, oh man, we're not gonna get past this one, are we? Uh, we this is uh, talking about the potential for an understanding around love, okay? A connection around love. So if you are single, does this mean that some love partner is just gonna come out of the woodwork and ta-da, I'm here? If that should occur, get video and send it to me. I don't think it's gonna happen though. Uh, this is more about <laughs> your awareness around what you want out of a love partnership. And if it has anything to do with feeling whole and complete, like you feel like you're half a soul, you're already in trouble. You're already in trouble and you're gonna leave yourself open for someone to come in and feed off of your soul. It is not okay, all right? But if you're, and you've been flying solo for a while and you're like, you know what? I'm, I'm ready now. Maybe it could be that kind of beautiful realization of I'm not afraid anymore. And maybe you do. Maybe you do meet someone or someone you've met previously suddenly, suddenly kind of sparks in you that, oh my gosh, I have feelings for that person. That person makes me not want to hide anymore. Why am I not afraid? I've always been afraid before, but with this person, I'm not. So there could be this illumination around love. Now, if you are partnered and your relationship is not healthy. This is going to really bring things up to the surface for you to work on it so that you can have a reconnection. Or um, for some of you who have beautifully been married for decades, God bless you. Uh, this is going to be some way of really showing your partner just how much you appreciate them. And um, I don't know, so I have a feeling that someone's gonna It'll just, it, these words just sort of uh, trickle off your tongue and it's almost sentimental, but the sentimentality doesn't come through as anything less than genu uh, genu genuine. <laughs> I can't get the word out. <laughs> words tripping off my tongue, right? Um, but yeah, there's something that just kind of falls out of your mouth and you're like, I just love you so much. And maybe you're not the lovey-dovey type. It's something unusual, It's but yet genuine. So it's not something that will put your partner off. It'll be something they've always wanted to hear. And it's just the right time for you to say it. All right? I want to make it clear. This is not you conniving, right? Or contriving what you're going to say to try to get yourself out of a situation. This is a genuine um, expression of love. So good day, guys. I am sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye.